Well, the superintendent at Beaver Creek City Schools says that district is rapidly running out of space due to its growing student population. Officials say the elementary schools are operating at capacity and the district could consider building a new school. Tunis reporter Kristen Escout talked to school officials and the community about their growing needs. This discussion comes just two months after voters here failed to pass a school levy. But the superintendent says something has to happen to accommodate the growing number of students. Beaver Creek's superintendent tells me the district's elementary schools are operating at just over 100% capacity. Parents I spoke with say that news isn't surprising. My son goes to one of the buildings that happens to be significantly over its uh, listed capacity, and the teachers are doing a great job, and the staff does a great job, but the classrooms are very full. The classrooms, they're at capacity as far as how many children. There's, there are so many kids in a class, so they're tight. That's why the administration has begun work to craft a master plan for how the district will handle its growing student population. Superintendent Paul Otten tells me the district has several options, including building a new school, adding on to current schools, or bringing in portable classrooms. But any new construction would require voters to pass a bond issue. I do think our community recognizes there's a pretty significant need when they see the growth happening. Our elementaries, um, parents at our elementaries, they see our large class sizes. Parents I spoke with at the meeting tell me they would be in favor of a bond issue for a new school, but some fear it could be a tough sell. Voters here narrowly failed to pass an operating levy in November. The superintendent tells me he's collecting public input now to put out a proposal the community can get behind. This is a growing community. Uh, we're busting at the seams. And, and the nice thing about a bond issue is you get to see it. You can see the, the value of a new building. The superintendent tells me the earliest a bond issue could appear on the ballot would be November, but again, it's just an idea, nothing set in stone just yet. The superintendent is hosting another public meeting in February. In Beaver Creek, Kristen Escow, 2 News, working for you.